kids, welcome to this video. This is a new activity and coloring book. It is from the church for us kids, uh, gallery in the family of God. Well, uh, now we're gonna have fun. I love it. Well, let's see. Before you were born, you were a spirit in heaven. You lived with loving heavenly parents and you are part of their heavenly family. Draw a picture of yourself in the center of your heavenly family. Well, I am a child of God. What does it mean to be a child of God? Hmm. Well, let's think. Your heavenly father loves you very much. He wants all of his children to return to live with him forever. Find your heart to represent his love. For behold, this is my work and my glory, to bring to pass <coughs> to immortality and eternal life of man. Heavenly Father talks us a plan that we allow us to return to him. This is called the plan of salvation. It is also called the plan of happiness. Find the path that leads back to your heavenly home. Wow. Oh. Beautiful. Who is part of your heavenly father's family? Salvation means you can be saved from sin and death and be able to return to live with your family in heaven. Match these events to the current plan of salvation. Premortal life, birth, earth life, death, spirit world. Wow. Wow. Resurrection, Hitman, Celestial Kingdom, Terrestrial Kingdom, Celestial Kingdom. Who is blessed by the plan of salvation? We were told that Jesus will be, will be very important to the plan of happiness. He will make it possible for us to repent of our sins and be resurrected. This loving gift is known as the Atonement of Jesus Christ. What does it mean to repent of your sins? Well, you were excited to hear about this great plan of happiness. Draw how happy you were to hear that there was a way for you to return to your heavenly home. Hmm. Can you remember a time when you were really happy? Ask your family members about your happiest moments. Hmm. You were told, told you will need to leave your heavenly parents for a short time to be born to a family on earth. Try to find <coughs> the ten difference between these family picture, pictures. Wow. Teach me to walk in the light. What are your family's favorite things about the earth? Hmm. Well. And look at this. On earth. Uh, you are given a physical body. Your spirit and body work together. Connect to the to see two mortal bodies. What are some things the spirit can do without the body? Well. You will have many experiences here on earth 
It will help you to learn and grow. Treasure people that are having an earthly experience. Wow. Look at this. Ask your parents or grandparents to share a learning experience from their own life. Your time on earth is a time to enjoy and have fun. It is also a time with challenges. That's the five challenges with their opposite. Wow. It's sad. Wow. Hmm. What are some fun things you do as a family? Even though we try our best, everyone makes wrong choices, challenges, mistakes, and wrong choices help you to learn and grow. They are also part of the plan of happiness. Follow the pathway of challenges, mistakes, and wrong choices some people make. Hmm. What shall you do when you make your own choice? Heavenly Father knows life on earth can be hard. He uses the Holy Ghost and angels to help and protect us. Usually angels are not sin. Sometimes they are. But sin or sin, they are always near. Trace angels around the earth. Hmm. Beautiful. Discuss with your family different ways Angels help us. <laughs> Heavenly Father sent His Son, Jesus Christ, to help you by paying for your sins and being resurrected. He knew that Jesus would need to suffer and die for you to be forgiven and resurrected too. too. <clears throat> ah, I love this picture. What does it mean to take in Jesus' name? Here I am. I am this boy. Um, the atonement of Jesus Christ blesses you with, with the wonderful gifts of repentance and resurrection. And this means you pray to Heavenly Father about your sins and tell Him, you, you are sorry. Then try your best to do better. Trace the boy brain to complete the picture. How does the atonement of Jesus Christ help you and your family? To use the gift of Jesus' atonement you make promises with Heavenly Father, and He makes promises with you. You make these promises through ordinances and covenants. Your first covenants are made when you receive the ordinance of baptism. Draw yourself, yourself being baptized. How long does a promise last? Have you made any promises with your family? Here I am again. You're asked to remember the sacrifice of Jesus Christ each week when you take the sacrament. Draw yourself preparing to take the sacrament. Beautiful. What do you what do you promise to do when you are baptized? 
Baptism, receiving the gift of the Holy Ghost, repenting, and taking the sacrament are important steps for returning to live with your heavenly family. Look at the goodness you make that bless your life while tra traveling through the midst. Which members of your family have received ordinances? God asks those who have been baptized to help gather his eternal family. As you do this, you help others to receive gifts of the tongue of Jesus Christ. Trace the words to see different different ways you can help people closest to you. Talk, invite, teach, testify. Who was the first person in family in your family to become a member of the church? Hmm. You can help gather Heavenly Father's family by helping your earthly family. Remember to pray, read the scriptures, be kind and serve each other like Jesus did. Draw another way you are able to help your family and others. Wow. What are some of the things you can pray about as a family? Missionary work is another way to help gather the family of God. You may do this by inviting a friend, church, or family home evening. Another way is to be a good example for your friends. Write your own name on the missionary name tag that also shows the name of Jesus Christ. Wow. Called to serve. Has someone in your family gone on a mission? Where did he or she go? Will you be the first? Wow. 